Welcome to a producer's life. Hi, today I'm doing a spot of gardening. So these plants have been planted from seed and they've finally you know, grown up. I've left them in the porch to soak up some of the heat and light and been watering them. So it's really nice to see that they've grown. And what I'm going to do today is I'm just going to transplant them into a patch that I've got some soil in and um, hopefully it should be, you know, help them grow. And then we can start. I've already taken my first two here. These are peppers and chilies and beans. The thing is, the sun's going to come out, so um, later on in the afternoon, the sun will hit that patch. So I want to see if I can find a way to shield. to shield the sun, like the real heat of the sun. So I'm gonna get these into here. Uh, I would have used the back garden, but um, where I was planning to do it, the soil isn't enough and isn't ready yet, but this is, so I thought, well, might as well work with what you've got. Let me just dig a trench. I think that's probably the best way. I've got my spade here. And I'm just gonna dig a trench. Three, probably three rows. All right. I'm gonna do three rows. Try and take off as many weeds. This place was just packed with weeds. So it's, it was very difficult to try and actually completely clear them. So I did my best and then I just raked over it. Resettle. So I put water on this last night. Let me just be careful with that. I'm just holding them. Let me lift this up a bit. Holding it like this. You can see, oh, a nice root system there. It's got a nice roots going there. Manhandle the roots. Hopefully that's okay. So I've got those two in. That's good. Now, since I'm doing the big ones. At the back as well, I think I'm going to do the courgette. And I've never grown courgette before. And for me, I'm just kind of going with the flow, to be honest. Um, the ones that I grew from seed, I... Uh, from seed, I just put in and then the tomatoes, I cut a tomato, sliced a tomato and then just decided to put it in and that I got from there's a bit of space in between the two things there so hopefully that will be okay I'm gonna get this out Ooh, nice roots so I want I want this one, and I think what we're going to do with this, what we're going to do with these. Let's put these aside for now. Yeah. I'm digging this in an awkward way because I'm trying to film and I don't want, you know, my foot and everything to be in the way. So I think I've got one, two, yeah, four healthy ones. Be able to see here that need to be spaced out. So 
let's just break this up a little bit. All right, so we'll put one here. This one can go, I think. That one didn't make it. Put one there, put one there, put the other two there, so. All the soil around it to prop it up and then oh, really press down firmly just to keep that in place if I find a stick at some point I'll put one next to it what it looks like just sort of a trench here here we go chilies oh I'm excited about these because I hope um, I'm hoping they really grow through and plant and uh, produce some oh, produce some chilies for me because I love chilies Right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to gently pull this out. I have to think of a strategy. I'm going to put my hand down the middle and turn it over. Just turn it over. Try and get it out a bit. Oh, there we go. There we go. It's coming out. Whoa! Quickly, quickly, quickly. Ah! Come on. Come on, babies. I think I've lost one. I've got a casualty. Chilly down, chilly down. Mm, will that still work? I don't know. Okay, let me put that there. And then try and get the others the best way. Let me see, first of all, how deep do these roots go? Because then that will help me decide. Oh, okay, let's just assess. Okay, so that's what we've got here. This one's pretty well grown and they're about an inch about an inch deep the roots so I actually don't need to go that deep here on there put on there let's get some more oh. this pot lying around so I decided to fill it up with soil and I'm going to plant some of those chili seeds the well the chili plants in there as well and um, because I'm <laughs> as you can see I've got quite a few seedlings that have grown and not that much space in front and the back isn't ready yet so hey uh, More planting and um, filling in around the plant, pressing it down just to make sure that it stays in place as well. Um, but I'm trying to space it out just so that there is enough room. For Sprinkling a bit of water. So 
I watered the whole patch and then later on in the day, because the sun was really, really hot today, I watered it probably about twice. So I'm really looking forward to tasting these when they grow because these are chilies. Now to be honest, I'm not too sure whether they're, they're peppers, I'm not too sure whether they're the bell peppers or whether they're chilies, but either way both of them <laughs> I really want to have and um, I, what I did was I basically had the plant, the, the, the vegetable and I took out the seeds from the vegetable and that's what I planted and that's the seedling for those. So. So we've got French beans all the way across, apart from here where we have a courgette. And then I've got chilies on this line here, all the way across. And I might put another row of chilies as well. 